Good morning, good evening, or good afternoon! Thank you for joining us once again, the Modemsters of Gaming. I'm Kaiju, can't believe I'm trying this again, Kay. And with me here is Necro, not again, Nick. Say hello, Necro. Hello. And behind the driver's seat, a new member to our group. Say hello, Mr. Subliminal. Hey, this is Subliminal. I'm gonna be playing Unturned for a few... This is, I think, what, my second time? Well, this is the first time you're being recorded. First yeah. time being recorded, but I... Took the liberty of learning some new things for the game. So, unlike a certain game. other member of our cast, he actually began ex inspecting and looking things up for his game, so he'd be ready for it. Isn't that right, Necro? <laughs> hey, you telling me that? I don't know what you're talking about, Necro. They won't be talking about you, Necro. Would I, Necro? Even though you didn't learn anything about Dark Souls. <laughs> Anyways, so this is unturned in the upper right corner right now. You'll see all the information you know about it. It's a Minecrafty kind of game where you're fighting in a zombie apocalypse. In the bottom left corner, you'll see that we have six little icons. From top to bottom, they are his current health, hunger, water, well, I guess drinking, water, what do you want to call it? And radiation. Well, that's actually illness, sickness, etc. Energy, and of course, your breath, which you need when you go underwater. And this is a stealth slash builder game. He's going to punch a cactus. And, uh... <laughs> Nope. This is a modded game, of course. We've modded the crap out of it. Okay. Unfortunately, there are so many mods that I'm just going to put a link in the bottom right corner now of our mod collection. It'll be a collection of all the mods that we're currently using. That way, if anybody wants to play along with us, they can. The current map that he's on is called Damnation, the full release. And he's currently running around like a nutcase in a game where he should probably be silent as hell. <laughs> and yes, you're not seeing things wrong. He has green hands. And that's 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 subliminal right there. Yeah, he's, he's kind of freaky looking. I figured I'd go for the look of a zombie. Now, of course, today is of course May fifteenth, two thousand sixteen, the day after my little brother's birthday. So shout out to my little brother, happy birthday! And uh, Juggernaut Jared was supposed to be here. Oh, 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 oh I'm this kind of animal. <laughs> <Yep. Yeah. laughs> no, no. <laughs> That's and here. Oh. the match ends with a quick one, folks. <laughs> Bing! One death. And, and the zombie just slowly walks away. See, subliminal, this is why it's a stealthy game. Especially since you're currently naked. I know, I was trying to get to the building and find something good, but, you know, apparently that didn't work out as planned. And you're in a different location now, too, don't forget. Oh, man. You respawn in a random location. You're next to what I saw. I thought it said Rachel's Burgers or something like that. Maybe she has good burgers. Mm -hmm. Good burger, home with a good, good burger. burger. Can yeah, I take your order? <laughs> I gotta watch out, because before I actually had to eat that carrot, only because I fell down the cliff. So. Well, yeah, running down a cliff at full speed, probably not the smartest thing to do in survival situations. But, hey, we can't all be winners, right? I really wanted to go to that. Hey, 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 he's not a complete now, loser either. Now I'm walking away from. Well, the then turn around and walk towards the nuclear power plant, which will probably kill you too. No, I'm gonna take. I'm gonna, I'm gonna look for a weapon before I go. Yes. Smart thinking. <laughs> I like the way he thinks sometimes. Sometimes. Yes, like when he charged blindly into a building only to get his butt kicked by a zombie wearing a face mask. Oh. Just hurling things in every direction. How do you want to see? I don't sit down right now. I'm watching him play. I'm trying to learn because even I don't know anything about a lot about this game. Well, yeah, your top count is how much? Hey, listen, I hold the record of dying in under 13 seconds the first time I play. When I played for an hour my first time. Or what? How long was that? You you played for 45 minutes before you finally succumbed. You know, it's funny. I died a lot quicker in the recording than when I was playing in that. Hey, listen. <laughs> Once, once you once you start Ugh. the recording and you realize you're talking to people, your game skills drop. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, definitely. That's yeah. kind of why I don't talk much during Dark Souls. No, but. you don't do it during Dark Souls because you're dying horribly every time. Shut up! I'm also shitting my pants half the time. Yes, that's why he wears Huggies, folks. Yes, it's a Huggies brand sponsorship deal. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. But if Huggies wants to, Nick will wear them. <laughs> What's that go that for? Well, you never said no, so that's kind of an iffy right now. I'm kind of saying no right now. Well, then say no. No. Well, then fine. We just lost that sponsorship. Congratulations, Necro. You've ruined us. Anyways. You. <laughs> back to the game at hand where he's currently darting around violently. 
Again. Don't we learn this was a bad idea? No, I'll never learn that it's a bad idea to run around. Why, why would I do that? Well, you survive a lot longer. Ooh, a flare, alright, finally something that's useful. Flares are kind of the, uh, Destruction. Hey, hey, come over here kind of button, you know. You see a bunch of zombies, you can throw it and the zombies will go running towards the flare. Oh, man. Like, so Oh, come on! Well, throw the flare over there by the tree, then the zombie will leave the house. True, true. I think I threw it too far. You <laughs> threw it too far. Oh, no. no, I didn't throw it too far. Oh, stop, stop! Stop! <laughs> stop! Wait a second! Hammer <laughs> time! Okay, now go! <laughs> There, there was another zombie. <laughs> There's always another zombie. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Just punch the cupboard open. Ah! Well, you know, you could always try different ways to open it. <laughs> open it with your head! Open it with your head! That's why we call him Concussion Fred. Anyways. <laughs> hey, with those spikes that he has on his head, he might be able to. Yep. Oh, wait, what you got in there? The old t-shirt on. T-shirt, huh? And that's a bandana. I don't want the purple hat. Hey, you've already got a red one right now. What's this? Corn, corn seed. I'll use that. Well, eventually you'll use it. You can't use it right now. Pick up rain barrel. Ah, uh, you can use that too. I right. know right, every piece of clothing you wear in this game gives you a little bit of extra space. Okay. Mm. Now no one will know what you really are, except you don't have pants. <laughs> That's okay. I don't need pants. <laughs> he kind of did. Just let him go to his own dream. I'm, I'm in. Um, this is a nudist colony right now. Did you okay. check upstairs? No, I don't know. Oh crap! <laughs> 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 Fuck. It's, uh, forget it. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba. Oh my. Oh. Well, at least there's an oil tank right there. Yeah, but you need a gas tank to make the oil tank useful. Ooh, that's like a stabby, like stabby weapon. <laughs> now he's randomly pushing buttons, folks. I think the pressure's finally getting to him. Just jam that F button while you're jumping. There you go. Now you got a stabby gun. Yeah. Stab him. Have a gun? It's a stabby gun. Yeah. Uh, no, it's a knife. <laughs> I stand with you enough times. How, how, how did you twist the weapon? Just tap the F button. Every once in a while, they'll just twist the blade. I don't think it actually does anything, but it's just you know, you can now walk up behind zombies and stab them to death with it. If you sneak. Oh, he's coming at you! Stab him! Stab him! Stab him again! There you go. And he drops something behind you. Uh, an ace clip, which is a type of gun in this game. There we go. Now he's going stealthy. Now it takes three stabs with a knife to kill a zombie, so. Get him. Of course, if you stay stealthy. <laughs> what? If you stay stealthy. Oh, look at all that blood. That's, that's really nice. What's actually. that? Barely. You kind of do bonus damage when you're stealthy. Oh, you do? Yeah. Oh. You sneak up on the zombies, they don't know you're there as long, and they just. <laughs> stab them to death. Oh, I need a gun already. <laughs> Yes, folks, there are guns in this game, too, but sometimes they're far and few between. My guess is you probably have to go to the military bases to get guns right now. Or maybe the nuke. Let's, let's the it's a nuke! What kind of guns do you want in a place which is that damaging? Yo, listen, I a know we have... Gun. I know we have armed guards <laughs> up at the one up in Wilkes-Barre. Or, Berwick. Correct me if I'm wrong. Where am I at? Here? You're wrong. So, I am not. We're not armed guards. <laughs> Sorry, no. You gotta get it right. They are not guards. Because they're not there to guard anything. They're there to kill you if you come on base. They're not going to lead you away in handcuffs. They're going to blow you away. They are armed assassins. <laughs> Their point is to take that scope, put it over your head, and if you step over that line, they blow it off. <laughs> they're not guarding. They're killing. <laughs> get it right. Damn, you knew I was there, huh? So it's probably because you're not crouched. I was crouched. Oh, I wasn't. <laughs> That explains the speed of the walking now. <laughs> explains a lot. Remember, if you hit shift or you jump, it pulls you out of crouch mode. Uh, so if you do either one of those things, you are automatically in trouble. I need to find a place with water and food so I can at least have something. Well, you know, there's a map. There's a map. There's your map! Hey, now. I'm the one that told you there was a map. Yes, and you're not even using it! You did all the studying on this game, you're like, you know what, I don't need a map, I don't need a map. Nah, I don't need 
Yeah. You, you are you are running in the middle of a desert. You're not even going towards. You are actually not going towards anything right now. That is not true. My pointer's pointed towards the nuke plant. That's where I'm going. Oh, I'm sure you're going to find plenty of food and water in the nuclear power plant. Why not? Well, first of all, it has the word radiation on it. You don't have ex Anyway. <laughs> I got a knife. That's all that matters. All right, folks, get ready to raise that death counter up a few pegs. I got a feeling it's coming up soon. No. No, no, no. Maybe a few times. I think that's water. It's sh the funny thing is, this is another one of those games like in Daisy where you can't just drink from the water. Which is a game that we plan on playing in the future once we get more of them on computer. Yeah, that's, that's definitely a multiplayer, try not to kill each other kind of game. Although, from what I'm hearing, it's actually starting to lose a lot of its player base. Why is that? Uh, there's a lot of games that are coming out recently that are kind of taking over the spotlight, you know? Uh, the, the modding community has become so rich and. Uh, well, it's just become so rich that no one really. A game like Day Z, which when it first came out, it was incredible, and it still is to this day, in my opinion. Great game. Where am I at? It looks like a health station or something. I don't know. I see some first aid books. Yeah, well, eggs. Hopefully, I have something. Here. Um. <laughs> that looks like scrap. I think actually, I think you might be at a junkyard. Oh. <laughs> My luck. Well, there might be something inside. <laughs> As he goes flying around at half the speed of sound here. And tries to break open metal bars. Pretty sure if he swung enough, he'd, he'd break something. Probably the knife. Mm. Oh, wow, I guess you got to go around the fence. But I do see things in there. Oh, nope, you can go right in there. Nice. What we got over here? We have... Pick up car jack. Oh, the car jack. You got a car jack. I wonder how useful that's going to be. Now, careful! Sneaky. Sneaky. <laughs> Sneak. <laughs> I feel like that. He might. I don't know. Him. He might be a pretty big guy. You might have. You might not be. You see, I, I added a mob which has different zombies. I don't know if he's a big guy or not. Nope, he is not. All right. Ooh. You got a golf club now. Yeah! <laughs> Trying to night iron somebody in the head. Nah, I'm gonna make a I'm gonna make a hole in one with this. <laughs> not if you're swinging like that, you're not. Ooh, hammer! Hammer time. <laughs> <laughs> hey, did we get enough ID counting for the past couple days? Ooh, it's a blue item. A metal bar. Nope. I wonder how much damage it does. Metal gate. <laughs> well, so far he's found no food. <laughs> I found food earlier. Yeah, and you already ate it. <laughs> Did you? I ate it and died. Oh yeah. He he decided to go into fisticuffs against a zombie twice his size, and then he tried to run, and the zombie said no. Oh, I didn't even realize I was in crouch. It looks the same almost. <laughs> you're not in crouch. You're not in crouch anymore. I repeat, you are not in crouch anymore. You're <laughs> that golf club sucks. Turn the knife back on. I remember, crouch. Oh, he'll learn or he'll die. You know, that's the whole point of the game. Hammer time! Alright, let's see here. What was it? Here. Yes. Oh. You can make bandages and stuff. I know that. Well, I forgot where the bandages were, though. I may have done my... I may, is this it? No, that's a bedroll. It might be underneath the uh, plus sign. That normally stands for help. <laughs> Actually, I think you can just make them in your inventory. I think that's what it is. Oh, there it is. Where? Scroll up. All the way up. All the way up. Is that in it? Oh, well. Hopefully you made them. Uh -huh. And you didn't turn them into something else by accident with your rapid spam clicking. Oh, the, the blood's vanishing. Is that a bad sign? I don't know. I, I've, never, I've never been around long enough. <laughs> Usually I've killed things and been gone by now. <laughs> oh, he must oh, have been wow. one of the big ones. <laughs> okay, well, turn off shaking. hammer. He's shaking. Put the knife back on. Yeah, seriously. Did we not tell you about this? 
Seems, seems the knife is the only way to play this game. Oh, now he's got the golf club and the hammer. He's got to actually equip the knife. Oh, not the car jack. <laughs> Hit him with the car jack next time. Hit him with a Swiss you know roll. Be funny? You know what would be funny? If the car jack actually does more damage than what I have right now. I wouldn't doubt it. I mean, it seems that the guns have a basic, uh, basic damage ratio. You can go across the water if you want. I think you need food or else you can die. I have a feeling when he goes to this radiation-filled nuclear power plant, he's going to die. So really, he's just clutching stones at this time period. Don't let them know. <laughs> I think they know already. I hope I'm going in the right direction. No, I'm okay. not going to the right direction. But hey, there's a village over there, I think. I hope. I hope there's something over here useful. A zombie! <laughs> He'll be zombie. very useful for you. Go and shake his hand. For a second there, I thought I was walking on ice. He's walking on sunshine! Whoa, oh, zombie! <laughs> oh, great. I'm going towards a mountain, basically. Is that what that would be considered in this game? I think it would be more of a plateau. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, Let's see. I hope there's food up here. <laughs> I think you put me on a map that barely has any food. No, I put you on a map that's large, and you decided the first thing you were going to do was run into a zombie if you spawned in the middle of the desert. Where you happen to be now. Oh, this is great. I, mean, I say you just keep making it to the nuclear power plant. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I mean, I only have 10% health, but hey, you never know. What's the worst that could happen? You die? Yeah. I mean, I already died already, but that's besides the point. Hey, listen. You died. Big deal. That happens. Thanks, Come Obama. Back. No, Come I on. actually think I need three rags in order to... Oh, 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 oh right. There is a house in here. Is there any zombies, Careful. Though? Yeah, you're right. Yeah, There's your guy's is just shaking with a knife. He's, he's afraid, that's what it is. He's just well, afraid. Of course he is. Blood loss, no food, no water. He's just afraid. It's okay. This guy's foobard right now. I think I found a piece of food, actually. Look at that. No, it's just a can. It's, just a can. it's not even food, it's just a can. It's an empty can. Someone ate it before they died, so... I think somebody's... From the looks of it, this place has seen better days. <laughs> oh, that's, nope, that's just a book. Is there food in here? Is, is there food anywhere? I am literally... Remember, you're not crouched. It's okay. It's Wait. okay. It's okay, I'm safe. At, at this point, he doesn't even care anymore. Just, zombie's gonna burst out of the wall. There's nothing in here. This has been the biggest waste of your time so far. But on the plus side, you just have a little further to go to get to the nuclear power plant. You know, my luck, I'll find, like, a bunch of big zombies. Like, please tell me there's no, like... Oh, yeah, that's right. You said you got, like, what? Modded awesome. zombies. There's that, 66 that new powers, zombie types in the game. To have powers or something. Yeah, they like won't. That? They won't. But they don't show up day one. But they slowly filter in throughout the game. Oh, I um, think I can see the nuke plant from here. Yeah, I see it. It kind of looks like a top chef hat. Well, the good well, news. The good news is it's not running, so you don't have to worry about any energy coming out of it. Bad news is it's not running, so there could be radiation leaks. <laughs> There is the fact that if it had power, though, and there's a soda machine or a food machine, I'd be better off. If you had money. Yes, <laughs> because in theory, they would cost money. Well, they do. I've played on maps where they, they cost money. In fact, you can build generators later on as you level up that you can use to power up, like, towns. You're hurting, uh, my, you're hurting my feelings. You're making me feel useless right now. Welcome to how I feel all the time when he plays this. <laughs> you're making me feel Oh, it's okay. I'm close. Nice. Well, you're gonna have to pause the game, buddy boy. How do I pause it? You just press escape. <laughs> escape. All right, folks. This was up for Subliminal's first matchup and unturned. Um, hopefully, uh, we actually do something more exciting next time than watch him shake like a leaf with a knife. <laughs> we'll be back in a few seconds with even more unturned. But until next time, I'm Kaiju Gay. I'm Necker Nick. I'm Subliminal. We'll see you guys later. Peace out, everybody. Peace.